Hello, welcome to Waffle Star Games. It's so good to have you back. So last time in our tutorial for Java games, we made a custom button class for all of your custom button needs. But I've since modified the custom button, so it'll look a little different in the end, you'll see. But anyway, today we're going to make our own menu using a background here and music that I can't play for you and not being so it'll be a surprise now um okay let's get started first things first we're gonna need a menu class oh by the way the main class is just the same as the other one except with a nice little blank empty space here nice little healthy space to add the menu Let's go ahead and do that right now. Actually, menu, menu equals new, menu, add, menu. Alright, so let's edit menu so there aren't any errors. We're going to need the AWT package. Of course, we're going to need, um, let's see, JPanel. That's a given. We're going to need... Actually, we're gonna need box layout. We're gonna need. Box. We're gonna need. Wait a minute. Let me think. Oh, yeah, we're gonna need our music stuff. So, have a x.sound.sampled. A dot audio system here I'm gonna go ahead and copy and paste this over and over again dot clip dot audio input stream all right excellent we have our imports so menu extends J panel and input wait a minute no it doesn't implement anything right so for our super constructor, we're gonna need public menu. Um, let's see. Oh yeah, first set layout to new box layout. This box layout dot y axis. See, um, add, um, see, box dot create vertical strut. Two what AD. Um, wait a minute. Before we do that, let's go ahead and create our menu button. So, wait, no. How about after? Alright, so moving on. Um, menu. Wait, menu. Bleh, I mean, custom button. Custom button. Button equals new custom button. Start. Oh, yeah, it's going to be a nice looking custom button. And say add button. Oh, wait. Button. First button dot set. Alignment Y or no alignment X to I believe it's this dot. I think it's one of it's a constant. Here, let's just say J frame dot or J panel dot. Oh, right, center alignment. We don't need the J panel dot because this is a J panel. And finally, add button. Then add box dot create vertical glue. And you might wonder, well, what is all of this about? A box layout is simply a layout where you have boxes, this, 
and it's basically adding invisible components to push the button down so it's not just always floating in its default position that's all the box layout does okay so now that we've done that I suppose we should start on the music Alright, so we're going to put all of this in a try catch statement. Alright, first, audio input. Now, first, we're going to need the URL. Oh, that's one thing I forgot to import. Import java.net.url. Let's see. URL equals menu dot class dot see get resource and it's just gonna be music dot wave um next we have audio input stream mute no audio right equals new uh, no right you can't just make an instance of it. You have to call audio system dot get audio input stream from URL. Say so clip music equals audio system dot get clip music dot open audio music dot loop and then say you can either say clip dot loop continuously but that's really just negative one yeah that's the value it probably has an if statement if negative one repeat otherwise just play it alright so that's the music now all we have to do is override public void paint component prefix g Oh, right, um, super dot paint component G set background. Wait, don't really need to do that. Just say okay, um, and G dot draw image new image icon of menu dot class dot get resource background dot jpeg dot get image at zero at zero six forty four eighty this oh that's what I forgot to import I knew I was forgetting something from the Java X dot swing package Forgot to import the image icon. Uh, this is just one of those. Yeah. Um. Now we might want to have some kind of thing to have this do when it starts. So how about we have? Oh, I've got it. Um. Public. Boolean started equals false. And then say if started else, uh, I mean, if not started else, um, Maybe I don't know, draw a blue rectangle. Maybe set background 
the color dot blue. I don't know. Is something. Wait. Let's see. Public void start. Started equals true. Wait. For what I'm doing, I don't need this to be public. Actually. Um. And maybe I can say. Button dot add action listener new I'm sh okay I'm gonna need two more imports abstract action action performed. So it's going to need action of an and abstract action. Alright, and now we just say start. So there. That's a basic little function for our custom menu. Alright, let's run this. See how it goes. Oh, what, right. I was thinking, why isn't it running? Because I have to run this class specifically. If I hit the play button. Ah, here we go. Here, I'll turn up the volume so you can hear it. Yep, that's your surprise music. Oh yeah, one other thing the start method should do is remove the button. Let's see. Remove all. That should work. Don't even mock me there. Don't leave comments like, haha, that was so funny. We all know it's funny. Just don't, don't mock me, okay? Everyone makes mistakes. I guess one of mine was forgetting to have this repainted. No one will mock me now, it'll work. Ha! Ha! That is what happens when you fix your mistakes. So, thank you guys for watching. See you next time. Please subscribe and like this video.